please click the subscribe button and the notification icon. It will help us a lot. Tremendously. I mean, I wish I had you back then because you hear about people that picked up ZBrush or they picked up character modeling and their work is phenomenal. And it's like they picked it up in less than a year and you're like, what? Because, you know, back in the day, there wasn't, there wasn't much in the way of tuition. You know, there was no, you got like those ginormous thick like books, you know, and that, that was about it. There were no magazines, there were no courses, there was no Google, no internet tutorials or animation mentor or anything like that. So learning was very slow and, you know, it was a long process of experimentation, whereas now people can get courses doing exactly what they want. Like there's Mold 3D, which just does courses, well, which does some really good courses about character modeling. With, and there's some people within that course that do character modeling within a specific style. So now it's not just about learning 3D as a generalist thing. You can actually specify a particular style or a particular thing. Like you can learn 3D modeling for 3D printing. You can learn 3D modeling for animation. You can learn 3D modeling for stylized stuff. It's very, like, it, it's great because there's so many resources out there now and there's so many tutorials and everybody on places like 3D, 3D Total do tutorials as well. And there's people on Gumroad and individual artists that publish books and PDFs. The internet's just changed it a huge deal. I mean, there's just so much out there now to learn from.